What's up, y'all? Hello, my pretties. What magic is being done? Okay, for those of you, not really who, we might come across who. I feel like y'all pretty much already know who. It's a new weirdo every week, okay? Like, um, what's his name said? Offset. It's a new weirdo every week. So, I don't know. What's, what's kind of read? Nourishment. Y'all, y'all could be um suffering from a lot of different health attacks. Y'all, some people could be forgetting to eat and stuff like that, okay? Make sure that, um... Make sure you're loving on yourself. Definitely making sure of self-care because I feel like there's a lot of um, attacks on health. Some of you guys, there's somebody here who just who be eating ice all the time. There's a person here who, who eats ice. Okay, mirror magic. Someone envies you and is trying to steal your essence to become a mirror image of you. Dream attacks. You are under the attack of spiritual en entities that are trying to defeat you in the astral realms. Okay, target is someone thinks you hurt them and are mad and out to seek revenge. So listen, I feel like you guys are having like issues in a dream state, okay? I do feel like you guys are having issues in a dream state. I feel like there could be a female energy that could be sexually attacking you in a dream state. All right, so be careful. Um, yeah. That's what this feel like. Like, you may even have, like, a woman that's, like, sexually, like... Like, like doing some sexual stuff to you in a dream state just because she wants you to release your energy, okay, to her. Look at this love spell. This was at the bottom of the deck before that was coming out. It's saying someone is casting love spells to win your love. What? So somebody doing love spells on you. For some of y'all, I, I picked this up a lot, especially in Leo. This has to do with like um an ex, okay, that's doing, that's doing love spells that want you back, but they're also upset. You know what I'm saying? And they're out to seek revenge and kind of like only pulling you towards them to hurt you or some shit like that. Someone is using mirror work to bring you problems and eggshells. Make sure y'all wiping down y'all mirrors with, um, what you call it, ammonia. So anyway, Rainbow, massive su success is coming to you after you release someone toxic from your life. So listen, you could have let somebody go, okay, already for those of you that have already done this, and this is them upset, okay? This is them upset with this someone thinks you hurt them and are mad and out to seek revenge. Now, um, for others of you, you still have a person that's in your life that you need to let go of. You know, if things ain't popping, shaking, and moving how you would like it to, it's probably because you got somebody around you that you need to let go of, and you know exactly who it is, okay? Okay. You know exactly who it is. Somebody, somebody could be you. Somebody using demon magic from the Marine Kingdom. Okay, I told y'all all the time. I always be picking up these people that be messing with these water spirits. Like, like, I pick up a person who who be chanting this particular water deity's name. being guided to um i just i was gonna say I'm, I'm being guided to pull one more but i said but i was but i said i'm being guarded okay so you guys are protected all right you guys are protected look at this black salt power use black salt to break hexes and repel unwanted energies you see this you see this right here someone is using divination tools to pry into your personal life for their advantage this is exactly why 
this candle needs to be used, okay? Cover me with your holy cloak of invisibility. Conceal my energy from enemies known and unknown. Hide my past, present, and future from unauthorized diviners and divination. Confuse those who spy and pry into my life with malicious intent. Amen. This is that in invisibility candle that I have on my spiritual warfare candle line, okay? Yeah, because this this is this is for reasons like this. Somebody looking in looking into your life to find out where is it that you're receiving blessings and stuff like that so they could go ahead and stop it you guys so i just heard hard head hard head i just heard soft ass behind that so 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 whoever this person is to me it feel like that they have been warned like they've been they've been warned to leave you alone they not listening and so a hard head is gonna make a soft ass is what i'm getting show me this mirror magic energy about someone envies envies you and it's trying to steal your essence to become a mirror image of you. That's crazy. And I always say that. Like, I be having those type of enemies. Like, the ones that talk shit about me, don't like me. That's what they say. But then in the background, they, like, doing work to, like, be me. <laughs> oh, God. You know what I'm saying? The type of person that'll talk shit about you. Oh, yeah, you're, you're this color. You wear this color, that color. You wore this outfit, that outfit. And then the next thing you know, they wearing it, okay? First they, first they laugh, then they copy type energy of is like that, okay? Yeah, so this person. Let me see. So show me the four cups. Four cups. Yeah, somebody wants you, like somebody literally wants you to get bored with your life or um, discontent with something that you're doing in life. Like somebody wants you to like gracefully bow out of something, okay? This could be a person who does the same thing as you, okay? They could be in, they could work in the same field as you or whatever, okay? It's like they want you to gracefully bow out. They're sending you um, energy of like projecting onto you energy of like discontentment. So they can hold the crown. This you if you, you a female, this could be a man. <laughs> yep. You know what I'm saying? You're you a female, this could literally be a man. You could be thinking that this may be a female that's doing this to you, but this could literally be a man. I'm also picking up that whoever this, whoever's doing this to you could also, also be doing this to you over a man, okay? You guys could have had a problem over a man, okay? Uh, this man may have liked you better or something like that, and now here go this chick want to steal your energy, okay? So she can be like you. This could be so your ex, like a, like your ex's like um ex or his current or whoever. I don't know. This is over a man for some of y'all. Just a just a little old man, <laughs> right? Somebody has pink hair. Yeah, somebody got pink hair. Mad over man. You should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> Mad over man. Should really be ashamed. Let's go to the dream attacks. Hierophant. Justice. So somebody just could literally be your husband or your wife. Okay. That is attacking you in your dreams with the Hierophant and the Justice. We have Taurus and Libra energy here. So somebody could be trying to, um, this feels like, ex, like, um, how do you, how do you say this is boundaries. This is an issue of boundaries, y'all. This is an issue of a person not adhering to boundaries. Like they're coming into, I, I, I just heard drive a roll down a partition, please. This is literally making me... This is a dream walker. Dream. Uh, 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 uh. This is a dream walker. 
And I picked this up before. You could be just in your dream. There's something going on. You know what I'm saying? You're just dreaming regular. Then all of a sudden, this person pops up. I feel like when they pop up, they pop up with a with a with with like negativity. Like there's always something negative that transpires. Or even just seeing this person in your dreams could be negative because, um. You don't like them or want them around. Or you could literally be dreaming of like um fighting in the in the astral realm. Yeah, this this is past stuff too. This is making me feel like whoever this is, they want to bring up memories. It's it feel like a husband or something like that. Who's doing this? Because we have the hierophant injustice. I don't know. Like that's making me feel like Yeah, that's making me feel like somebody who you close the cycle with, okay? Somebody who you close the cycle with. It could literally be your mother, a Libra. Or your mother in Aquarius or whatever. Somebody who you close the cycle with. They want for you to um to think about them a lot. Yeah, look at this. With the, you see this the hang woman? Like this is somebody who is like trying to put force thoughts onto you into your subconscious like this person may have apologized to you in a dream state or you know i don't know i feel like i feel like this person is looking for some sort of reaction from you okay they want to be a part of your life or i don't know they want you to feel regretful for um not dealing with them i don't know okay it just feels like this person wants to be remembered okay they want to be remembered after you the world after you close that cycle it feel like you're doing good Nah, they want you to dream about them, okay? This person is wanting to stay on your mind, okay? So targeted, someone thinks you hurt them and are mad and out to seek revenge. Page of Swords, look at they like, how can I, hmm, how can I? They, pl they plotting and planning, like constantly, constantly. This is a sad energy to be in, yeah. This person wants to trip you up, tie you up. They want you to be unable to defend yourself, okay? That's what they really want you to do. They want you to be unable to defend yourself. So they might even try to get people to gang up on you or might try to hit you where it hurts or your weak spot or um, attack you without you knowing. We have the Six of Cups. This could be somebody in your family. This could be a Capricorn. Look at this. It's a lot of energy of wanting to bind you. Like, somebody really wants to bind you. It's like there could be somebody in your family or some shit like that. Who's mad and what they mad at? Let me see. Let me see who's mad, who this is that's, uh, that's out to get revenge. Who is this? Who is this? Somebody that used to do your hair. It feel like somebody that's done your hair before. Somebody that may be in your family. Y'all may look alike. <laughs> this could be over some money. Okay. Somebody's name could be Tommy. Look at this. It, say, it says friend. Okay. It says friend. This friend could this friend could be intuitive. Like I said, going back to over here, this person could be into the same things that you're into. Okay. Um, this friend could be intuitive. This is a shape shifted. This is a shape shifting friend. Is what it feel like. Whoever this is, this is a shape shifter. I feel like this person has the ability to be very fake. Um, there's something here about this person not wanting you to have the um spiritual abilities that you have. This person is praying on your downfall as far as your health is concerned. Seriously. Like, they're literally play, pray, praying on your downfall as far as your um, health is concerned. And there's something here about a ponytail or a bun on top of another person's head. Yeah, so that's, that's this person's problem. <laughs> Yeah, the magician. So they this this is somebody who this don't even feel like somebody who know what they doing. I'm gonna be honest with you. It just feel like somebody who like literally like probably be online and stuff like stuttering. Like they type it in like, hmm, how to find a bitch? Go right search. 
They could be, this person, like, I, they telling me, like, this person looks at, could be, could look at um, photos of you or look at something that lets, lets them know, like, what you're doing, okay? This could even be that divination stuff that, you know, they were saying um, about spying and using divination, right? So, however they spy, it does feel like social media is what I'm getting. Like, however they spy, they can see, like, what you got going on and then they, and then they go, you know, get their tools and get to going based off that uh, this person doesn't feel skilled to me like they just don't like i feel like the, the strongest thing about this person is their jealousy i don't even feel like they magic hold any type of weight nothing like i feel like just it's just their evil eye is really strong i feel like their evil eye just their bad intentions that they have for you in the brain is stronger than any anything that they're doing i feel like this person don't even know what they're doing you could be spiritual and this person wants to be spiritual too. That's the thing. Whoever this chick is, she could always be in her car or something like that. This could be a Leo. Cancer. I don't understand. I don't show me show me what the moon is. It's gonna be a Scorpio too. Show me what the moon is. She could have messed with somebody you used to mess with. Something about this King of Cups. I don't know. Like it just feels like a, a bunch of bullshit is going on behind your back because this chick is so pressed. Or whoever this is is so pressed, right? Um Whoever this is is so pressed. But somebody they wanted to ruin your family is what it feel like as well. If you was in a relationship with a man or whatever. This person be saying like, like I feel like this person be like, I'm going to do this to her. I'm going to do that to her. Like fight in the air and shit like that. But don't, but don't ever say it. Like, I feel like don't ever say it. Don't ever say how much they hate you. There's somebody who's, who's dangerous because they can smile in your face. Whoever this is. Yeah, this person may have wanted, wanted your relationship to be over. Your romantic relationship to be over or something like that. So, let's see who casting the love spell. Let's move forward. Love spells. Someone is casting love spells to win your... So, with the eight of coins, this could be somebody you worked with that's casting love spells on you. Somebody who you used to work with. Mm, I feel like they want to be on your mind. They want to confuse you. They want you to be confused. They want you to think about them like, you know, a lot. You moved forward from this person. There's somebody who you left. You don't deal with them no more. You couldn't even physically move. Like, yeah, like, oh, I feel like leave me alone. I feel this energy of leave me alone. Damn. Damn. That's how I feel, like, gosh. You already hurt me. Like, I feel like whoever this is have already hurt you. But they're but they're but they're working on your on staying on your mind. That's what this could be. They working on staying on your mind. Somebody could have just dyed, dyed their hair red or something like that. Look at this King of Swords. He getting on my nerves because um I could feel his energy. He just wants to be like in everything you do, he just wants to be there. Like I just wanna like I just like come on. This is annoying. It's like I could tell like this person hurt you before or something happened. It was between you and this person. It was tumultuous. It's like, all right, so leave me alone now. It's like, no, I have to be in your life. I want to wear your wings too. That's how I feel. That's how I feel. Because remember this, this person up here who envies you and wants to steal your essence to become a mirror a image of you as well. Like literally could have been a man that was doing that. Or like I said, it could have been over a man. But whatever this is. Whoever this man is, he's giving, like, real creepy vibes. Giving creepy vibes. Yeah, and then what, three of cups. What's this? Look at this. King, we have the king of swords, the three of cups, and the king of coins. Like, what? What is this? 
what is this? Two of Wands. He won it all. This somebody, like I said, okay? Like I was saying, this person could go both, both ways. Like I said. I feel like this person, I feel like this person talks about you a lot too. Like, I feel like they run their mouth about you a lot. Look, this says master of a trade. <laughs> I find that funny. You know what I'm saying? I find that funny. Like, like I said, trade. This person go both ways, it feel like. lack of faith like this person like wants to eat off of you like be, they see that you know whenever your life is at harmony and balance they really you know want to suck your blood this is a vampire this is a vampire look at this we have removing negative energy like they, this person looks at you as like a charging port for like their 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 battery like they want to yeah and they do this through sexual um like through through love and sexual energy and mixing their energy with yours and stuff like that. Like this person is just and like I said, this person like wanna wear your underwear or some shit like that. They're weird. Okay, with this word spirit energy, I feel like this person is a snake. They're a snake. They embody serpent energy. Like I could I could feel them like whispering in your ear. Something about this person's voice or or um just Helping them out that you could succumb to. Stay away from this person. They feel like they feel like they're irresistible to you. Okay? That you can't resist them. Show them different. Okay? You don't need that person in your life anyway. They they life suck. <laughs> okay, they looking to come eat off of you at whatever whatever position you are in life. Okay. So it says someone is using mirror work to bring you problems and issues. Make sure, like I said, you're wiping down your mirrors. Yeah. They want to stall you. This person wants to stall you. They're projecting certain energy onto you. What's the Empress? Some of you guys, uh, it's something here that you could be worried of. Yeah. Some of y'all, some of y'all could be worried that you're going to lose something. You could even be worried about your children. abundance your abundance this is worrying okay but the mirror work i feel i definitely feel like projection and worrying show me the hang woman projection and worrying somebody edges could be falling out or head could be falling out or something like that you guys could be worrying about if you're ever going to be in a stable relationship like i said saying here about children y'all could literally be worried worried about your children or worried about having children if you're ever going to have children these are these are problems and issues that you would you know even draw to you with with this law of with the law of attraction you know what i'm saying just constantly thinking negatively yeah they're projecting this energy onto you worry about things you'll never be this da, 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 da. like i said with the two of cups they're projecting this onto you yeah they're trying to make you feel overwhelmed as well okay listen you guys you're overwhelmed with blessings don't ever get that twisted don't ever get it twisted this person is trying to sway your judgment okay and make you feel like your life sucks when it don't. Yeah, you might be overwhelmed, but it's because but it's because you're being blessed. You have a lot of blessings. I feel like whoever you are, you have a not a lot of knowledge, a lot of goals, a lot of things that you want to carry out. They could be trying to project um this energy of addiction onto you, toxicity. Think, 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 think. Um, smoke, smoke, smoke. Don't you want to be here right now? Um, yeah, like this is this is about distractions. Your prayers have been received. That's why I said this worrying shit is, is, is for the birds. Literally, this worrying shit is for the birds. You're fine. Something about a baby. You guys are worried about a baby uh, or, or having a baby or when you're ever going to have a baby, you know, st stuff like that. Okay. If you're pregnant, you could be worried about if you're, um, if you're going to have a, you know, carry your baby full term or if you're going to have a healthy baby because you do know that you're being attacked or something like that, you're going to be fine. Okay. Just stop worrying. Okay. Cause we know what worry does. It calls in negativity. Show me massive success is coming to you after you release someone toxic from your life, y'all. Yup, look at this. Here we have the three of wands. Things are things are coming to you after you 
release a person or things, you know, um, because you left the person, you'll definitely be receiving a lot of success. Here go, look at him with Knight of Swords. Why, yada, yada. Somebody who always wants to fight. Somebody who could be domestically violent. Okay, somebody who always, like, I, I've just heard three cuts in your eyebrows trying to wild out. Jay-Z, this person could like to listen to Jay-Z or something like that or rap in the mirror. Like, this is a, I, I heard, this is a wannabe. I heard they called him a wannabe. A wannabe. Somebody could walk with a, um, with a, with a bop or a limp or something like that. Yeah, you need to let this person go. Let him fight himself. Let him fight the air. Okay? Yeah, I feel like he in the background, though. He's in the background, like, literally whooping, whooping whipping up something i don't know a promise or something like that you're the only one i want in my life this person might come back with a sob story after it's over you need to leave leave that person where they where, where they stand this could be a scorpio that you're dealing with here i gotta drop every card i've been reading for y'all for hours okay Six of Wands. This person is going to be watching your victory. Really, really, really wanting to find ways to sneak back in after you've removed yourself. I feel like this person will be sitting back, really plotting and planning of how to get back into your good graces, sharing your blessings, okay? Especially with this Ace of Coins here. You know what I'm saying? I do feel like you have blocked this person and they're trying to figure out how can I get past her? They're telling me that this is the same person that's doing the love spells, all right? Watch out what you eating or drinking from some somebody or I don't care what they offer you or anything, anything like that. I'm hearing like if you share kids with this person, anything that they send with that child home, back to your home, get rid of that shit. Don't tell, tell, tell your child, don't bring me nothing from such and such house. Don't bring nothing from such and such house in here. <laughs> okay. All right. And then remember you guys, crowned in a read was nourishment. Okay. Make sure that you're taking care of yourself. Clarify the guides, energy, guides. Yeah, you guys are going to definitely be receiving downloads. Oh, that's why they're making sure that you nourish yourself because, um, you know, you need to be able to integrate the energy into into your body that they want to bless you with, okay? It's like uh, uh, instilling some sort of knowledge in your DNA. That's what a download is. You don't know how you know shit. You just know it. This feels like an energetic upgrade, especially with the nine of coins um, that dropped on the floor, right? So I hope that helped.